bitches love salsa. Yeah, homies don't. I told y'all months ago, and you heard it first here, that Lil Dirk was separated from OTF. There's similarities of what Chief Keith did and what Dirk did, right? This is breaking news. And I'll probably make a separate video on this. But Los got a public defender. Los don't got a paid lawyer. Go look it up. Los got a public defender. That's number one. Number two. Even if they give bail, there's no way in this world. And this is why I think that Chief Keith didn't bail out old boy. I mean, didn't bail out dirt. <clears throat> It's because of this simple thing. If you do that, and they are not signed to anything, anything like that, they're going to watch every transaction, not saying that they are or not, but they're going to start targeting that money, laser-like focus, and that will be the relay wire that will charge up the whole shit. Lil Dirk has no choice. Now, you can have OTF, bail them out but if you do that you might have to file a chapter 11 bankruptcy not a chapter 7 a chapter 7 just means you ain't got no money you can't pay for nothing chapter 11 means you have to itemize things to show why you can't pay for it and that could drag out I don't think that's gonna happen I just that just don't make sense to me so let's talk about the ways <clears throat> Y'all know that Dirk unfollowed a lot of people. A whole lot of people. There's certain people, and y'all can figure it out, that he unfollowed that you didn't even know. But, at the end of the day... <laughs> it looked like he getting his chief key for him. The problem with it is, is he realized it too late. The real reason why Chief Keith really got up out of there... Was one, he realized he couldn't save everybody. Y'all could talk about disloyal and all that and everything like that. And because it was Lil Durk. Y'all talking about the Lil Durk now. Not the Lil Durk in the past. I'm not going to talk about his kids, mom, or nothing like that. Anything like that. That's disrespectful. But what I'm trying to say is, that Dirk was the street dude. Because y'all want to, yeah, he was not with his baby mom and he wasn't taking care of his kids. We're not doing all that, bro. But, let's keep it all the way authentic. That Dirk was the street dude, the dummy, the stupid idiot. This Dirk right here is the one with money. Got to figure out how to keep it. Buying his mama a damn house. You know what I'm saying? Shouting out his girl's cosmetics and all that on a Drake track. That wasn't that Dirk. You couldn't save that Dirk. You cannot save people who don't want to save themselves. It don't work. You don't believe me? Check out Alcoholics Anonymous. But the biggest thing, and, and I think y'all keep on saying it, Dirk's talking about he want to finish high school. He was talking about brands and stuff like that. Y'all remember when they needed that bread and Chief Keith went and copped a car and a, uh, a, a, a chain and all that and everything like that, and so many fans got mad and cash from the old got mad and hit cuz house and everything like that. Allegedly, and one of the people who allegedly hit his house is incarcerated right now. And they, you know, you already got all the videos out there, and y'all got this dumbass sitting up here. Literally, <clears throat> I ain't gonna call him a dumbass, but y'all got this compulsive person, compulsive personality person filming himself talking about it. So, enjoy your diapers, but. Is Lil Dark acting like Chief Keith? Yes. Yes. There's no way he's not. Sometimes you realize shit is too late. And then sometimes you got to get started on shit too late. Either way, it happens. The party is over. Now, there's youngins right now patrolling old block and acting like they the super resistant team and all that and everything like that. I've seen the videos. Youngins, <laughs> bruh, if it ain't time for you to get some money, legitimately, 
and sell some records, sell some features and all that. Y'all can come out with a group called the Last of the O, Last of the Ohicans or something like that, cuz. Then y'all just waiting. See, the police been already searching, I mean, doing a little looky lose and all that and everything like that. But now the feds got laser-like precision. What people don't know is the feds didn't only take who they wanted. They took a lot of other people, too. There's a significant... Well, nah, I ain't gonna sell that. Never mind. Just know that the ones that went to jail, the four that went to jail, weren't the only people that went to jail. And I'll let y'all figure it out, you other bloggers. <laughs> and then I'll go ahead and speak on it, because I'm not breaking no news on here. Well, goddammit, yeah, I kind of did with low situation. But we'll drop another video for that.